Hello peeps. I haven't been to the beach for beach coming for ages. I've been doing a lot of swimming. So I'm back to my favourite beach and I just want to have a little skelly through to see what's what. Tide's on its way in. Look at you. Hello, niceness. Oh, sorry. Oh, there's a lovely little bit of teal. Look at that tiny, but lovely. Oh. Very thin bit of sea foam. Got a bit of lime. Oh, I do love all the colours on this beach. Never fail to delight me. It is. When I'm trying to make earrings, I'm, I'm demented because you get two pieces that are similar in size like that, but they're completely different colours. But unless they're side by side, you don't know that. So you're, I poke through a box. Look at that little yellow shell. Um, and, whoa, sorry, I've just noticed this. Look, looky here. Can you see that niceness? Oh, isn't that lovely? Oh, yeah, and those of you who listen to me later on will be aware that that didn't go in. Do you see that colour? It is clear, probably a milk bottle that has manganese in the glass which reacts with UV light turning out that lovely lovely pale shade of lilac gorgeous now, gosh this beach has really changed shape again it's been a long time it must be about maybe four weeks since I've been here and it really has changed it's that very very pale blue I think it might not be, it might just be not very lovely clear. Um, sorry if this is making you feel <laughs> a little bit sick. I should maybe be showing you the horizon. So this really has changed shape. It's banked up a little bit more than it had been. Big old bits. Oh, there's a a little bit of sea foam, not particularly lovely. That's the problem. And I do have an awful lot of sea glass. I still can't resist it though. Doesn't seem to matter really. Maybe I should let you have a look at the sea while I walk along. No, because I'm not going to find what I'm looking for down there. I need to look at the ground. Look at that lovely stone. Um, there's a big old chunk of green. Oh, and I have a friend who started to make stuff, or who, who makes stuff, not has it just started. Um, he likes brown, so if I spot brown today, I'm going to pick it up. I'm not a huge lover of brown. Which is a bit rude. Um, these little bits of green are handy for... When I do pictures, I use those for shamrock leaves. Although this glass isn't very old, you know, uh, that bit is much older than those two bits. I think, oh, a bit of sea pottery. Boring. <laughs> Not quite good enough, I'm afraid. Let's see. I see little bit of that lovely kind of luminous green. Very pretty. Ooh, you want a big old chunk of brown? There's your... That's the boy, look at that. Half dried. Very frosty. And sea pottery again. Probably marmalade jar, a little bit boring. Nice olive, very olive. Okay, lots of seaweed, so you can see that that has probably that's probably the reason why the beach has changed. There must have been possibly a bit of a storm that has changed it. So. Oh. If 
if you like chunky this is always a good spot for chunky stuff it's not something I particularly love you can see those big bits there I spotted again a big bit of brown which I will take as I explained for my pal there's some nice driftwood actually a big chunk of <laughs> sort of different um, yeah, I don't need any driftwood at the moment. Look how frosty that is. It's kind of nice. Look at that bath boy there. That's enormous. Oh, look. There's something lovely. Hello, you. You're beautiful. <gasps> You're gorgeous. That really is lovely. What a wonderful colour. And I love those bits that you can actually see the bubbles through. Look. Oh, you're lovely. Oh, why can't I get that in focus? Because I'm a bit of a rubbish photographer, that's why. So, oh, a little bit of patterned glass. Pretty. When these sit on their edge, they do look really sort of blue, but they're not. Oh, but there's a gorgeous bit. Look at that. Lovely, lovely, lovely. It's been, uh, oh, look. The uh, rain has gone over not long ago. So the beach is damp from rain rather than from the tide up where I am here. But it works really well for finding there's a marmalade jar you can sort of see the stripey bits on that so it's helpful to me Let's see here there's a that's algae on the glass amazing and that's beer bottle nothing very glamorous but look what can happen I love that <laughs> look at that as smooth as anything from the neck of a jar I presume so you can see it's all sort of fluted in shape really pretty a screen again. I love it. Oh, it's the neck of a bottle. Look. Love it. I love it. Now, the question is, is that palest pink? I think it might be. Hard to tell unless you... Oh, look at how bright and white that is. Oh, look though. There's no mistaking that. Gosh, that is very pink. Not terribly, it's smooth, but it's not very well tumbled, interestingly. That's not a bad thing. That means there's been a good turnover of what's on the beach, which is quite good. It means that just the tide has uncovered new stuff. Always very exciting. This is just lovely. Oh, I've just seen another lovely colour. There we are. Oh, yes. You're my friend when you're that beautiful shade. You're lovely, lovely, lovely. This is where you'll find all sort of tinier bits. Oh, well, maybe not. You might also find bigger bits. And walk along this little bit of shingle. Shingle's always pretty reliable for finding little pieces in fairly not ordinary. Well, I say that. But sea glass is lovely no matter what it is, I think. Unless it's actually sharp and unfinished. 
quite thin, but yet look at the bubbles through it. Righty ho. Going to walk down to remind us that the joy of beachcombing is being on a beach beside the beautiful lapping waves, just so gentle today. There's a very, very, very gentle kind of misty rain coming down, Irish mist. So you can kind of see that the other side of the lock is hard to spot. There's a little yacht coming down. The guillemots are coming home. And County Antrim has one little bright patch of sunshine, which I hope will soon be here. But as we go down and look at the lapping waves, I want to say thank you, friends, for your company. Take care. Blessings to all.